Hello everyone. I am Arun Jhulkar. Today we'll talk about bond valuation. In bond valuation, we want to calculate the purchase price of the bond, which is equals to the sum of present value of annual income and present value redeemable value. When we talk about present value annual income, this annual income may be an interest or dividend. And to calculate the present value annual income, we use the formula of NOD. And to calculate the present value redeemable value, we use simple present value formula. First example: Find the purchase price of ten thousand rupees nine percent bond interest payable annually, redeemable at twelve thousand rupees in fifteen years if the yield rate is to be eight percent compounded annually. Here, the face value of the bond is ten thousand. Interest payable every year is nine percent. Redeemable value twelve thousand after fifteen years. Because the yield rate is eight percent compounded annually, so we say R is eight percent and M is one because it is compounded yearly. Now, purchase price is the sum of the present value of interest amount and redeemable amount. In case when we calculate present value redeemable value, we use this PV function equal PV function, and in PV function, first we read is required, so R. Divided by m, number of periods are m multiplied by t, then PMT. Is there no PMT is here? No periodical payment here in the case of redeemable value. Leave it. Then future value is twelve thousand comma zero. Type is zero because we are getting at the end of the year. Enter. So the present value redeemable value is. Minus three thousand seven eighty two point nine zero is negative because it's a outflow. Again, present value of interest amount because we are getting interest at the end of every year, so it's an annuity. So we use this formula or function equal present value function first is rate R divided by M, then number of periods M. Multiplied by t, and we are getting interest as a PMT amount. So PMT is interest over here. So interest is nine percent of rupees ten thousand. We are getting every year. Future value is not here. Leave it. Type is zero because we are getting at the end of every year. Enter. And the answer is minus seven thousand seven hundred three point five three, and the sum of these two give us purchase price, which is eleven thousand four eighty six rupees and forty three paisa. This is the purchase price of the bond, or you can say that the present value of the bond. Next example: Find the purchase price of rupees five hundred eight percent bond dividend payable semi annually, redeemable at one hundred five rupees in five years. If the yield rate is seven percent compounded semi annually, here bond face value is five hundred. Rate of interest, or you can say that the dividend payable every year is eight percent, but it is semi annually. So remember that that's why M is two, and redeemable value is five twenty five because it is payable redeemable at one zero five. One zero five means five percent premium. So five percent premium on five hundred is twenty five. So redeemable value is five hundred plus twenty five, five twenty five. Interest rate is or like the yield rate is seven percent, and so R is seven percent, and M is two because it's semi annually, and the number of years are five. Now we calculate the purchase price, which is the sum of the dividend amount, present value dividend amount, plus present value redeemable value. So first we calculate the present value of redeemable value using this function PV function equal PV function rate R. Divided by m, then number of periods m multiplied by t. This is no annual income. Like in the case of redeemable value, we are getting redeemable value at the end of the life. So this is no PMT amount. So leave it, or you can say zero. And future value is five twenty five because we are getting redeemable value after. Fifteen years, sorry, five years. 
then type is 0 enter and the present value redeemable value is minus 372.18 now present value of dividend amount equal PV function first rate R divided by M then number of periods M multiplied by T and dividend we are getting dividend at the rate of 8 percent of 500 because we are getting semi annually so multiplied by 0 0.5 comma this is a no feature value leave it type is 0 and enter the answer is minus 166.33 and the sum of this two equals to minus 538.51 so the present value or purchase price of the bond is 538 rupees and 51 pesos.